the countdown to Halloween begins. People are still getting into the spirit. Costume sales remain sky high despite the pandemic. So we have a roundup of the most year of the year's most talked about costume. Mm -hmm. The prize for the most 2020 costume goes to this homemade Zoom meeting. <laughs> So how does that even work? Is someone just walking around with a... Oh, that's oh. funny. That's pretty brilliant. And then you're in the meeting. That's, how do they even see? That is brilliant. Wow. <laughs> Jeff, did you see that Zoom meeting? Yeah, that's pretty good. That's a good one. Clever. Yeah, that's... that's Seems like it takes a lot of work though. Okay, so people can't get enough of this mini president and first lady who showed up to the White House Halloween celebrations last weekend. It looks like the kids made an impression on the president too. <laughs> of course, po political costumes will be all the rage. You can only imagine being it's an election year. So no surprise here that Mike Pence's fly from the debate is also a trending costume along with a sexy mail-in ballot. Of course, it's a sexy mail-in ballot, Jeff, right? <laughs> <laughs> of course, of course, it gets, although it's gonna, I don't know how it's gonna be everywhere else. Well, I shouldn't say, it's probably gonna warm up here in Denver. So the sexy outfits were gonna be limited, but it doesn't, <laughs> whether or no weather, let's take off the clothes for Halloween. I was gonna say, Jeff, uh, you and I are Chicagoans, and you know that a little weather has never, ever stopped a sexy Halloween costume, mm -hmm. okay? Yeah, just wear a nice Absolutely coat. Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> And check out what might be the most creative costume ever. This headless man riding a bicycle while playing a guitar is grabbing a lot of attention in Concord, Massachusetts. Whoa, that is so cool. That reminds me of Janelle Monet's costume from a couple years ago. If you guys had not seen it, she is um, like a headless with like the head here. Just Google Janelle Monet Halloween costume. You guys will die. What are you guys going to do for Halloween? Are you dressing up? Erica than Jeff. I don't know. Um, we are going to sit outside. Hopefully that it won't be snowing and we are going to get one of those uh, candy shoots. So are we and we're just and I got these Halloween glasses. They have like the metal hands coming up. Cute. So we're going to drink witches brew outside. Ooh, I Shoot like candy it. And thing. don't worry. It's supposed to be like 65. Thank goodness. Oh, Jeff, good. what are you guys going to do for Halloween? Are you dressing up? Probably just sticking around here. I have some old Halloween costumes that I've saved. One was a Cobra Kai costume, which Ooh. is very fitting today. So oh. I might break out my old Cobra Kai costume and put that on. But those were the good old days, BC before children, you know? <laughs> oh, BC, for sure, BC. I know those good old days. Speaking of sexy costumes, I used to whip those sexy costumes out. Okay? I know you did, girl. I know, you too, Erica. You still could. I don't know. I'm going to be a vampire because Sophie wants us all to be vampires. She wants to be a vampire slash bat which okay. they go hand in hand. So we're gonna have to like combine her costume. She wants Mark to be daddy vampire, me be mommy vampire, and then she wants Miles to be a werewolf. So <laughs> wow. yeah, she's so very controlling. The shot. She's definitely calling the I shots. I knew it the first time I met her. That's my girl. <laughs> Jeff, don't go away. Coming up on DBL, Kim Zolciak. What, Beerman? She tells what's really going on with her former